Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Hoping you guys are having a fabulous day. Today, I got a short video just to explain one thing to you guys and let you know what's happening over here in Grand Cross. If you want to do the channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button, leaving a like, and leaving a comment letting me know what you guys thought about this. Again, I do upload Grand Cross every single day, and I'm on my road to 1.2k, so help me out. Without further ado, let's jump straight into the video. Alright, so today we have a lot of new updates, a lot of things in the game, but today I want to talk about one specific thing. First of all, we do have the Happy New Year stuff, new challenges, new stuff. I will break this down in another video and explain everything you guys need to finish and do it on a timely manner to help you guys get all the rewards don't wait till the last minute on a lot of these things they have it where it's spread out and you got to do them on different 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 days so just keep that in mind but we did get a new banner we also got a pretty cool event where you guys can pick up some uh, equipment they really want you to summon on this banner and let me tell you something right now whenever net marble does this when they like you know they add this type of stuff on the side where you can get stuff that means they really really want you to spend on this banner they did the same thing with ludaseal i don't know how to say it properly i would calm down my bad my bad the other archangel so that means they really want you to spend your gems on this so that you guys can kind of have to grind a lot or spend money on a future banner who knows what's planned next people are saying it's going to be green easton uh, but again, I feel like there is one collab, which is Stranger Things coming up in the middle. And there's going to be some broken units to force you to summon on those as well. And we have the one Esquinar apparently coming out in March. Who knows with this global net marble, they might even like launch it earlier. And they might save, what is it, Assault Mode Meliodas for the one year anniversary. So, 600 gems, you guys can walk away with a guarantee of Sariel or Tarmiel. But here is the thing that I'm super super triggered about so for a global player looking at this banner you guys aren't seeing anything weird anything that's odd anything that's off about it you see yo sorry yellow tornado got a rate up my boy tarmiel got a rate up as well this banner looks amazing to summon on but the one thing that is triggering me slowly again you'll say yo it's fine it's fine dude i don't like making these videos where like i rant about things and i'm not trying to make this a ranting video i'm just trying to bring it to light why and i, I don't understand why actually i'm just trying to show you what happened with this banner so first of all on jp this on screen again i couldn't find the exact one i didn't i didn't play jp at this time when sariel dropped so i currently don't have like the screenshot of the exact images but there's a lot of differences demon hendrickson demon hendrickson is fine we literally got him for free over here on global so i can't complain about that he shouldn't even be on this banner it would just be you getting another free unit there is someone that is triggering me slowly lodisiel is not on this banner but looking at the rates here we're missing three units okay we're losing we're missing the archangel that i said before we're missing the fairy that is like with the archangel they both dropped in the same banner and we're missing holy knight escanor ned marble practically gave you the worst possible banner and they removed all the good things from it they literally went through and picked off all of the possibly good units Keep in mind when you're summoning on a banner, sometimes you like to walk away with something good on the side. I know I'm going to compare this to a festival banner, which is completely wrong, but like, think about it. You're walking away with Lily of Desire, Lost Van Meliodas, Goddess Elizabeth, Green Droll, Gamer Shin, Blue Easton, Red Dairy, Blue Mage Lilia, Holy Knight Escalor, Demon Meliodas. Like, bro, these two were also removed from the banner. <laughs> this banner is literally cheeks, bro. <laughs> They're like, honestly, there is nothing good here other than the two main units. Again, you can say, yo, they're on rate up. What are you talking about? Over on JP, they were on rate up as well. But at least if you miss the rate up, you can at least walk away with something not feeling miserable. Like imagine you go 500 diamonds in because that's all you had. You walk away with like five Matronas. You walk away with anything else on this banner. You're just feeling bad. Honestly, I don't see the purpose of removing Lotus Seal. Maybe because he released three weeks ago. Maybe because they, he was just here. They didn't want to like ruin people's chances because like they summoned before. And now it's like, why is he here? I could have just waited for this banner. I, I don't see the purpose of it. But this did happen. Keep this in mind when you are summoning. There is a rate up again, but you are missing most of the good units. Again, getting a copy of Holy Knight Escalor here and there is pretty good. Again, to 6-6 him. He's really good for a lot of things in the game. Plus, Demon Meliodas is like the king of Pierce. Removing him as well. Again, there's nothing else on that banner that's worth it. But yeah, again, I'm not ranting. I'm just letting you guys know what exactly happened. Again, I would definitely take a copy of Demon Hendrickson. He is not on this banner as well. I feel like Global rushed it to the point where they didn't want to overlap banners. Because you have Demon Hendrickson here and you have these two units here they just rushed it to the point where they were like you know what screw it they're not coming to this banner again they could have filled this banner up with other things but they chose not to they just added the filler units the deldry sims forgive me i am super super sorry but i feel like this needs to be said deldry is not a good unit great mage merlin she's okay 
Fairy King, all right, he's fine. Death Beers, all right, all right, he's fine. Adventurer Bond, okay, uh, no. Holy Knight Deanne, okay. Princess Elizabeth, you don't use her that much. Hawk and Elizabeth, you don't use her that much. Given the JP version, you would have had Demon Meliodas, Holy Knight, uh, Escanor, and you would have had the other four Archangel. Summoning on this banner before wouldn't have been a big, like, smack to you because you would walk away with at least one of the Archangels, right? Given that is Sariel, Tarmiel, and you would also might, you might had a chance to walk away with Ludaseal. But yeah, we'll see what's up next. I'm letting you guys know now. I feel like there's a big banner in the works uh, that we don't know about, or they're just planning on dropping the one Esquinor within a three week time frame. If that happens, dude, woo, I'm screwed. But yeah, thank you again for watching this video. I hope it helps you out. There's a lot of new stuff today. Again, go check it out. Log in today. We have a bunch of New Year stuff you guys can have some fun with. Again, I was not trying to make a depressing video or trying to rant or anything. My bad if it sounded like that. I'm just informing you guys. I like to make informative videos, so I hope that helped you out. That's been it for me. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your day. Again, I say this every week. I'm going to say it again. We did get one gem from the maintenance extension, and we got the three gems. Please go claim it so you guys don't miss out. You only got 13 hours again till tonight. Thank you again for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your day. Later.